Good evening, everyone. I'd like to welcome you all to the January 8, 2018 Conservation Mission Meeting at 7.06. The first public hearing is for 135 Webster Street, Eric Boyko. A continuation. Anybody here for that? Oh. Is so it continued? Continue? Discussion oh. item. Yes. Again? No, again? No. Oh. But on he here, it was continue. a continuation. Yeah. Today is a continuation, but... From how the, long um, ago? Oh, here we go, from December 4th. So, so right. Steve, do you know... No, I haven't heard anything from them. We're off a great start. Let's see. And they didn't ask for a continuance. Maria would have... mentioned it to me today. She didn't. Okay, so, well, because um, uh, I had written a note. I guess we did get the DEP number, because there wasn't one last time. Yeah. And we needed the Board of Health as built. And was the original file still open? Yes. And they needed a certificate of compliance, and you had questions the NHESP location. Yeah, which on side, that. which border, mm -hmm. on which side was priority habitat. Yeah. Who was the um, engineer for that? I think they were, I'm just telling you I don't know. Yeah, they all had the loss of approved previously. Yeah, was approved. Was, I think it was approved to put the garage on. And he just never got around to it, and his permit expired. Mm -hmm. So he filed just to do what he was previously approved to do. Well, shall we continue with board? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they show up. Okay, Steve, what have we got for the next oh. meeting? Uh, officially, or are we just postponing it till later in the meeting? What do we usually do? Well, if <laughs> they don't show they're not here, we just we postpone, postpone them. Yeah, yeah. continue. Well, we could postpone it until oh, the end of this meeting. I don't think they're going to They don't have to remember. They'll have to wait 9 o'clock. Well, I hope we're not here 9 o'clock. But we will be. Yeah, we have to be. And if they come at quarter past, they'll have to wait till 9 o'clock because we've already continued it. Hmm. Until like. Well, we don't have to continue it to a specific time, right? We can just continue hmm. it until later in the meeting and then go back to it at the end and close it and continue it then. So postpone it till later in the meeting without a given time and then continue it at the end of the meeting. That's your motion? So move. Uh, don't we have to continue to a time chart and the time chart? I, I, I we're not continuing right uh, now. We're postponing. Let's just post pass over then. I don't know what we're Pass doing. over to later in the meeting. Yeah. I don't know. If you know a that. different P word. Yeah. Like okay. One you like. Second. <laughs> Hello. Second. Oh, who's this guy? Is this in here? Second. Are you here for um, 135 yes, Webster? Oh, oh good. Party. Family issue. So. Luckily, it took us a while to come I'm taking back. Taking a motion off the table. <laughs> All right. So you're up. All right. Going up to the table. Now, um, yeah, we had needed uh, Board of Health as built. And was the original file still open? And the plan, we were looking to look at the NHESP location. We weren't sure which, which side. side. Yeah, um, I had actually, Maria had taken the as built as well as the paperwork to uh, um, try to do the uh, certificate of compliance for the old yeah. DEP number as I had received the new one for my new filing. Huh? She would. She's so doing as built. She be. usually writes stuff on my, you know, what she's done. All right. No, that's so, not right to you. So she be in there. And as she's not filling there. out requests. No, she didn't fill it out. I filled it out. She took it from me when I brought it in oh, to talk to her. Okay. She took it. No, she didn't fill it out. Oh, okay. I filled it out. I filled <laughs> everything out. All right. I was gonna say. Hmm. And there's no request the for request a certificate. Should be in, the, in the mail right there to be signed. Say that again? Oh, it, should be, it should be in the to be signed. Let's see. Let me take a quick look. And it's not under discussion either. So I remember you guys had told me you wanted to mm -hmm. finish out the old order conditions. No. 
The only thing that's in here are RDAs. There's no certificate. Mm. Anything, nothing else in the file? <coughs> Not in, um... Did you get the other information that we were asking about? About the I, plan? I had the as built um, about which side it was. No, I did not. I didn't receive that yet. I'm sorry, what did you give Maria then? I'm sorry, I thought you gave her um, the as built. The, um, she, I believe she took a copy of the as built. Okay. And Wait, but the, you said you don't have an as built. Um, from the Board of Health. Oh, the copy okay. I got from the Board of Health for the septic. Okay, so you still. And then his request for. Oh, well, this is a nice one. Huh? This is some. Sorry. The date on this was 06, but this is an original the plan. Original plan. Yeah, it's not an as So it's not an as So, Maria is not here. You want to come in Tuesday tomorrow night? Yeah, we'll go to Board of Health to help you with the, with the old file, the National Heritage and Game Species line that okay. might be on. It's on OliverGIS.com. Okay. Okay. Search for the address you can print off the map. All right, what's the website? Oliver, G-I-S. We can go to the Board of Health tomorrow night. Yep. And just ask for the ad bill for your property. Okay. Nothing on the certificate. Request no. for a certificate. No. Not in this file or yeah, right okay. here. in here. Okay. Oh, in here. Yeah, I know the... Um, the request for compliance I did bring to her and she took and told me that she was going to hand it off to mm -hmm. um, Steve. Yes, yeah, Steve? Yeah. Yeah. She said she was going to hand it off to you and that. I did it back to her. Yep. You got mail. Oh, you got and where would we get the information on natural heritage's priority habitat? Well, are you looking for um, well, the line? It should be on the original plan. You just don't know what side of the line it's on there's a line that's not right you don't know yeah we wanted yeah the house was in or out of it yeah um i can look it up on okay on the computer for that's good. it's all over gis it's the layers are available yeah i'm not gonna go do that no, no i'm no. just i'm just telling you yeah you no asked used where are we so yeah. will you go to the edge tomorrow night that? then i will come in tomorrow night what time stay <laughs> good this oh, is what i'm asking like who's going to provide yeah, us the applicant should provide information what time would you like me here tomorrow night uh, between five and six. Between five and six. Okay. All right. Perfect. So we'll continue this then. Yeah. So sorry about that. It's meeting. Okay. My wife's thirty-five weeks pregnant, so we've we've spent <laughs> uh, we spent a week in the hospital over the past month. So uh, it's been a busy month. Wow. Yeah. Seven fifteen. So move on two five. One thirty-five Webster. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. 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 Old and the NAGSP. And the as built. Yep. Oh, this pen's running out. Oh, you're so <laughs> excited. <laughs> so. Try that one. Maybe it's me. These gels. We're being too tight. Don't drink. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> No, that's okay. But yeah, it does. yeah, mine's cooking along here. All right, so that's continued until <coughs> February 5th. In the meantime, work with Steve. Yes, I'll be in tomorrow. Thank you so okay. much. I apologize again. Thank you. That's okay. No problem. I'll have a baby by that. Okay, 7.15 on the dot. We have a public hearing for 294 Northwest Main Street, Donald Farino. Hi. And we had needed the ZBA approval, I think, and they have it. Right? Yeah, that was uh, the last remaining thing, I believe, was just the ZBA approval, and they did give us the, the approval at their last meeting. So I, I brought you a copy. I don't know if you had a uh, copy of the latest, but the size copy yeah, of the latest. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, little bitty. Yeah. Man. 
Oh jeez. This is pretty small, <laughs> but <clears throat> bring American fine glass. <laughs> Binoculars. And this is off the res with a microscope. Do you know uh, which meeting here was the last one you attended? Last uh, December 4th. Uh, yeah. I have, the only thing I've written down is that they need ZBA. Were they, were they actually then. here or did they continue? Well, they, uh, they were here. No, I think I have here. I remember you were here in the meeting before. 11.30. Right. And, the, and the meeting schedule wasn't out yet for 2018, so they couldn't yeah. continue to this meeting if they wanted. They yeah. continue to the 4th just for a procedural matter, because the meeting scheduled for 2018 was voted on. Oh, okay. And then they continued real quick. In, I, in the, the previous meeting in November, they would have continued the oh, two meetings. Right. But the, since the meeting schedule wasn't no, out no. at the time you wanted to continue two meetings, they right. did a quick one in November, I mean December. Okay, let me see if she's got this typed up. Yeah, she does. She goes all typed up and ready to go. We just needed ZBA. That's it. So board, we'll put the DEP number. Friendly. What's your pleasure? I just a reader. No yeah, I will abstain because I've never been present during a meeting okay. where this was presented. All right. So I'll make a motion to issue the order conditions for 294 Northwest Main Street. Second. Motion been made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Aye. We'll, we'll sign that tonight. Okay. Extension. Make sure in a minute. Yes, and grant it. Did you want to keep that? Is this the, did you make any revisions no, after that's, ZBA? that's the last one. The ZBA has a, their own plan. And uh, what's the date on this? Plan. 11, 14, 17. The last yeah. week, the last week, the so that might have been the, the meeting the last time we saw them. Yeah. Well, before that. make sure they use this plan, not the ZVA plan. R right. The, the dimensions, the house dimensions and everything are the same. Their their plan is really scaled back. It doesn't show any of the wetland features. It just shows the building. Right. The so when line. they're going to. But they, they do match. Okay. We've, we've been keeping consistent okay. with those two. Right. <gasps> Mine stopped too. Oh, really? <laughs> That's why they're frozen. so cheap. <laughs> frozen, no. Yeah, right. Okay, so we're all set? Okay. All right, thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you. There she goes. <coughs> okay. So we can sign that later. Actually, do you want to pass it around and sign it now? As well. What is it? That's what I just did. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Okie dokie. So, Steve, do you have any um, issues with the uh, the voucher for items? They had. No, I mean they they they, they took down that one bush that we wanted. Yep. And um, I didn't really go out and check because it snows French. That's all set. Yeah. But I'm, I'm speculating it's, he said he did the work. Okay, so this is the uh, two grand, 2400 for items. And I did go out and check the Maryland Doobie property on Mantrock and it was done. It was well, we can check French on Thursday. <coughs> we'll know. Do you want to sign it? Do you want to sign it? And I'll, yeah. and I'll check it. Hold it. Hold the payment. Or well, yeah, first, if it's it. not done. Yeah, I mean, hold it. If, if yeah, it's my discretion, if you want. Yeah. Okay. No, that's not allowed. You will take me down if you start doing that. I Who know. put this I on for nine o'clock <laughs> in nine fifteen? Yeah, that's what I was asking earlier. That's what <laughs> happened at the last meeting. I kept because we were continuing them instead of continuing something to like nine o'clock and then nine o one. Yeah, 
I continue to every 15 minutes. You were here. You <laughs> should have caught it at the time. <laughs> but I didn't add I know. in the, the 9, uh, and these two didn't file, so I didn't add in the 9 and the 9.15. Those should have been moved up here. Check the tapes. No, those are new. No, that's Which ones? Those are new. No, we're not doing this. We're not yeah, getting into this. I think right. we would have noticed. Uh, oh, the public All of us work a full day yeah. except for this kid right here. We're not mm -hmm. staying well, all the public night long. meeting, we can take that well, anytime because it's an If RDA. the person is yeah, here. It's 9 o'clock. <laughs> All right, no. so let's, let's for right. the record, so on tape, say we no longer wish to schedule any public hearings past 8.45. Right. Mm -hmm. Done. Right okay, what's this? <laughs> <laughs> Says the That's peanut gallery. Mowing our fields. 8.46. <laughs> oh, come on, well, you can good signature. Oh, no. things and There's one of the other ones. Mm -hmm. I'm going to make this thing know. work. You could go in and play with the schedule. No, 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 trash. Look at that. Yeah. No, those were added. Yeah, that's right. I'm trying to get that rest of that in there. Oh, you think they'll accept them? said what? Yeah. Who is that person? And oh, this is Echotech um, for work that was done on the Southwest Main property, Bazile. It was for reviewing in anticipation of their notice of intent, because I remember we did vote to hire him to review mm -hmm. it. And then also the um, he did some work on the enforcement order for us. So that was 192.50 that we owe our one. Voucher. Thank you. These aren't gel, gel, whatever we That's why we, what they are. we thought we got <laughs> the goods. We did not get the goods. Good old right fashioned ballpoint. Um, it's a rip off. And they're sharp little suckers, too. So things never change. That's I knew this national grid. Yeah. Thing. So National Grid, Steve, they have a little hole they want to put up on Davis Street. They sent us a letter. Does everybody have that mm -hmm. letter? And Steve took some pictures. Mm -hmm. It is right above the way Bowl number 19. Yes, I remember where that one is. <laughs> <laughs> That's the oh, it looks like maybe you can see that. Right. Taking a little one. There's a yeah. pool right there. Yeah. yeah. That's, That's a pool. Yeah. Where are we, ballpark? So, right across from the high school. High school's oh, right thanks. here. Going out of town. Mm hmm. Right past the entrance to the high school. And the wetland's right below. A little wetland here, a little pocket. What do we usually do in a while? We put some erosion controls yeah. around. Yeah. We're good They're to go. Like that. All right, so can you... So they're adding another pole? Or they're I think they're pole. taking it out. They're going to try to use the same hole if they can't, they'll dig them out. Yeah. Fiber <coughs> holes, straw bales, similar treatment. Using a truck mounted auger right from the road. Yeah. Super. They do have a section oh, for erosion control. Nice visuals. Go National Grid. So was this email, Steve? Yeah, today. I don't know. Via standard and electronic yeah, mail. Standard. Electronic yeah. mail. Mm. It was written today, though. Okay. Can you... Um, <clears throat> was that written today? Yeah. No. Oh, December. December I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Close. I, everybody's awake? Yeah. Everybody's awake? Steve's awake. Um, it could be December. So, can you have email, um, Maria, email them back? Or if you've yeah. got a copy that, that we want erosion control? On the wetland side, place. Did you say it was already in there? Erosion controls. Mm -hmm. Oh, they've got it. On the back side. Yeah. If they have to do any disturbance, they'll put in um, fiber rules, straw bales, and yeah. or something. What does it say now? Under erosion oh, well, and yeah. sediment control barriers. Awesome. Oh, okay. I want to just let you aware that you know 
It says it's so necessary. Weathering kind of right there. Yeah, and well, if they don't have to dig a new hole, and they gave us pictures. They give you pictures, and which perfect. they don't want to. They want to just it's put it's it back. In the so what do you think? Don't have them, animal. Steve, send something out. No, no, we're good. Okay, we're good. Thank you, Steve. Just in case you're driving out of town and you're saying, hey. Mm -hmm. There's an auger in the wetland. <laughs> I like the idea of uh, more reliable electrical service delivery. The customer is in the yes. air. <laughs> oh, I like that. I like those words, that's for sure. So that one's done. And it's still got a couple more minutes. 125 Walnut Street, erosion controls. Oh. Wow. Oh. <laughs> well, what's the matter? Hmm? Walnut, yeah. Walnut. I know, right? You know, oh, that's off of South? Mm-hmm. <coughs> he came, you know, he's doing a crossing. He came in with a couple of bonds. I said, get a bond. Oh, yes. Destroyed that. One for the crossing, one for the replication. When you finish either, you can come back, you know, when that's built. I guess the, it's calls for as you cross and you have the, you have the uh, retaining area mm -hmm. on the side slopes, mulch. You want to use uh, native. Right. You want to use native leaves. Leaves. Native. Not as erosion controls, but it to stabilize it. Yeah, to spread over the. Yeah. Like forever, right? It wasn't asked to be loam and seeded. Like I said, because my it's answer was, day. "What's the plan say?" Yeah, I saw that. It just said mulch. I mean, did it really just say mulch? Can we check the plan? Plans. I would say, well, what you, whatever the plan is. I, I mean, his answer is, my answer would be, you know, do a court. That's what you approved, was what the plan was. Right, cool but he says the plan says mulch. I'm just curious uh, whether the plan was more specific than that. Yeah. Uh, do you have the folder with you? 125 Walnut? Okay. Mm -hmm. no. No. I think it's like probably a geo uh, yeah, layer or something. Or a mulch like sack, mulch sock or something. But if it just said mulch, then I don't care. Use leaves. Over the No way. Pinks? Leaves will blow away. I mean, that's not even a stabilizer. Well, if it's mulched leaves, yeah, no, he then you them can chop them because that's even more to blow away. Well, yeah, if he's raking leaves on there, then no. But if he's mulching them, yeah, they actually, mulched leaves makes an excellent mulch. If you're putting it around plants, mm -hmm. but this is on a bare surface, which is, I could blow it away with my breath, a mulch leaves. You gotta have, so. you know, something to hold it there. I don't disagree, I use them all Unless the time. Unless you water it. Well, that's true, you could ask them to water it down. But once once we put ours down, it stays there, it doesn't go anywhere. So I wouldn't care. But, but you're putting it around the thickness. It's not like us to just say, go ahead, throw some mulch down for erosion control. Like, Usually we I say I think it's for stabilization of the banks. Yeah, that's what I mean. I mean Usually we say we say to put a native seed mix or something. Sides of the crossing that was disturbed. I'm assuming he's talking about so because we don't mulch need is bottles and salt fences or whatever if we can have chopped mulch. No, I'm sure there's erosion controls as well, but erosion controls are at the bottom of the bank. They're saying putting mulch oh. on the bank. Straw bale silt. So we do have straw bale, we do have silt fence, we have proposed riprap. Riprap is think? rocks. Oh, yeah, I know. Not mulch. Got it. it. Still looking. Look at it. Chopped riprap. What do you got over there? I can't read that far away. Anything good? What about this right here? That's the replication right here. Oh, it says cross section. Maybe it says it in the direction for disturbance. Maybe over here. Erosion and sediment control measures, yada yada, during construction. Here's the replication though. We don't have yeah. Is that all to do with replication? Let's ask Eric. I think he—he's right here. Hi. Hey. Come on over. Come on up. 
this page. How old is this man? What's the thing? So, you know, oh no, guys, got it. Note number six. All disturbed or exposed areas subject to erosion shall be stabilized with mulch or seeded for temporary vegetative cover. So mulch or seeded. Oh, eight. That was 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. So he wants to put uh, native leaves. Mm. That would be a first for us. Uh, so we would generally ask that it be seeded with a native seed mix. I don't know. I can't comment on it because it's an Andrew's plan. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Sorry. It's right. the fifth. Well, that's what I. I just saw your name. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> so I that's what I would say. It. Can we just speak back to them that it says mulch or seeded, and we want seeded with it with a native seed okay. mix. Okay. Okay. I told them. Mulch yeah. Seeded. Yeah. Oh, and the mulch is going to be made out of? Well, she, well, she said seeded. Well, well, a mulch or prefer. seeded, yeah. she yeah, said. Now, I said we, prefer I read seeded. the note which yeah. says mulch is seeded, and I said we want native seed mix. Mm -hmm. So no mulch. Right. Okay. Hence the or. Yes. Native seed mix only. I know this is tacky, but so when your pen, <laughs> next time your pen freezes up, if you lick oh, it. Yes, yeah, so, oh, yeah, I know. I know. I know. It helps. I think you've just been sitting there. I just didn't know where these had been. <laughs> Nobody's been <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. I know. That's At the last point. meeting, were they doing the same thing? <laughs> We're all going to do it now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you 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 licked the jar. Yeah, oh, good. Yeah. Yeah. You licked them all. <laughs> yeah. Did you get to this one yet? Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, right after my uh, <laughs> typhoid uh, attack, I think that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have the 730 public hearing continuation for 30, 46, and 50 Southwest Main Street. Lawrence Fazio. Now, um, they haven't been back. Mm -hmm. We have received nothing from them, from their engineer saying they've told us no, to no longer come to the meetings like the last two times we've continued. So we sent Claire's out, we sent out a violation notice. Actually, we did not. Because I spent three hours. We did an official cease and desist to go out. Is I, that right? No. No, the violation was good. So and I think you guys voted at the last A, a lot of stuff got messed desist. up in December. I was yeah, saying for like Sounds three great. weeks. Yeah. And I did try All to right. work on it, but I couldn't figure out. December 4th, how to write the enforcement. Sending cease and desist and we are fining them a hundred dollars a day from this point on. Mm -hmm. so, so we did both. We sent an official written No, cease and we desist. haven't done anything. Uh, well we said no. we were going to. Yes we did. Okay. <laughs> and there's no way they can do it now anyway. It been continued like the last three meetings. But we something. wanted a correspondence, that's well, why we yeah. motioned for the cease yes. and the fine. Because and I we was Sick. Requiring. Okay. Of well, that's all right. Nature gave it's, him a cease and desist. It's now a month later, and what's the board's pleasure? Eric, um, Art Allen had done up a um, enforcement order, and I do remember seeing it in an email. And I think I emailed someone back that we needed a date for them to. And he said springtime or something. June. Yeah. He said file, June. Yeah. Restore. Yeah. And. I don't remember getting that email yeah. back. He emailed it but, pretty much right away. And I also said it also needs to say, and per our Douglas wetland bylaw up here, anything we send out mm -hmm. cannot be just the wetland so protection act. So that was going back. back. You, that was so going back and forth between was, you and Maria. So we that's were right. That. Mm -hmm. And then Steve said, well, Maria had emailed everyone to come in and sign it, and I, I never got that. I never got okay. that email. Well, so. so here it is, and there's nothing. So it's not typed been edited up. yet the way we want it. Correct. Typed. It says um, extent of activity, excavation and redistribution of soil within a bordering vegetative wetland, including placement of sand, creation of a berm dam, and lined pond with a controlled outlet. Disturbed area includes approximately 3,000 square feet of bordering vegetative wetland. And then the boxes checked are the property owner, 
shall immediately cease and desist. Uh, resource area alterations resulting from said activity shall be corrected and resource areas returned to their original condition. And a re restoration plan shall be filed with the issuing authority on or before. And there was not a date in there. And I don't is have the, anything to sign. Is the restoration plan applicable to the second bullet point? Is it the returning it to the original condition or is it something separate? In other words, is the third bullet point referencing the second bullet point? The issuing authority hereby orders the following. Check all that apply. Yes, what I'm trying to say is are number two and number three referring to the same thing with number three simply asking for a date? Or is number three asking for something different? The filing of a plan, the restoration plan. Right, the plan for what's in number two? Resource area alterations resulting from said activity shall be corrected is that a restoration? areas return to their original condition. Okay, I just want to be really no. clear That's because that, if I were an applicant or somebody getting that, I'd start like, working on it right away. Well, I'd say, right? do you want me to work on it or do you want the plan? Which one? You want me to fix it or do you want a plan about how I'm going to fix That's it? That's why I yeah. had so much confusion. I yeah. couldn't figure out what to write. And that's why I said, but we'll hire an Alan to do it. And he's checked off all the boxes. <laughs> <laughs> so this is not correct. This should be the plan. We want him to come in with a plan. That's the bottom line. Last okay. Meeting, the last so meeting minutes said, said says we find them 100 bucks a day. Yeah, but then we never gave him the cease and desist, so <coughs> we really can't do I'm that. Right. Yeah, that would really be fair. Myself. That's no misleading. Yet. So yeah. box number one <coughs> and box number three should have been checked only. I don't know that that's true either because I'm still not. Let me see what number two <coughs> actually says. I'm just saying this so that we can articulate clearly to mm -hmm. the uh, homeowner what it is we're asking. Okay, so what are we doing with the public hearing that's right mm -hmm. now? Because this is separate from the public hearing. Well, we can um, close it and deny it, deny it, and well, we got to be specific on um, well, the, the lack of information. Is for the ANRAD. Yeah, yeah. I mean. We don't have any new information. It's been you never got a revised plan after our Ellen went out there from Three Oaks or whatever. Oh, okay. Sorry. So uh, number it, it's clarified right below number three. It continues on, although it doesn't look like it's part of the same paragraph, but it is. So it's saying that here when it said that they shall correct mm -hmm. it. Then this one says a restoration plan shall be filed for the restoring the area to the pre-existing conditions and the removal of all blah, 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 blah. So it's very clearly stated. You just have to continue reading to the bottom here. Oh. Right? So we need to pick a date. June 1st. Wow. For the, for the filing. <laughs> this is for the plan, for the restoration plan. I'd say a lot sooner than that. I mean, I think we should be looking at a plan so that we could actually get things going by the time... Uh, we think the weather's March 1st. Sure. I mean, or sooner. You can do March 1st or sooner. That's not going to prevent them. So I'm sorry, I jumped in there. So you guys were saying we need to uh, close this hearing out. Well, we didn't get a request for continuance, but the hearings for the ANRAD, which I think was pretty much completed, and we, I mean, we have to go through this. There's a violation on one of the lots, and the applicant hasn't been yeah. back. Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't grant a anything at this point. Plan. You can't not show and get your stuff approved. Uh, not even not show, but not communicate, and not and be in violation and get your stuff approved. It doesn't. It can't work like that. But so to close a public hearing, it would be a denial for the reason of. Insufficient or information an and a, uh, an yeah. existing violation. On one of the properties in the ANRAD. Yeah. Well, the, the ANRAD is just for delineating the wetland. That's what the public hearing is for. The violation is something With that the was, property discovered, was discovered as they were walking the property. On one of the lots that is included in the ANRAD. That's right. Well, we had questions we asked at the last time we met with them about the ANRAD. We had questions that we wanted answered. Okay, good. They were supposed to answer it at the next and meeting, they and they've back. never come back. So for insufficient I'm just information... I'm making sure. That, there you go. Yeah. So for insufficient information, we deny the ANRAD and close the public hearing. That's my motion. Second. Motion been made and seconded. Any more discussion? 
All in favor? Aye. 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 And you can also ask town council for them to draft up the denial. Yeah, Not just saying they were wetlands that weren't added to the plan that Art had discovered. So we still there don't was have a revised a new plan. plan before that woman got relieved, the Three Oaks lady. Mary Ann DePinto. Yeah. So they they did add on like the watering hole and then the extension and. So what were we missing? That we have to a deny this. A person to J lack present of the plan. Well, we don't. And we that's never not asked. a reason for a denial. We don't have what a plan. Did, what were we missing? Where's the plan? You just said that they presented one. Do we have it in our hands? Do we have it here yeah, at this meeting? You said that they presented they, they presented it. Last time they were they presented it, but we had questions <laughs> regarding the violation with, and that's part of the ANRAD, the violations in the very wetland that they are trying to delineate. And so if we have a violation within that wetland, that's an issue with the ANRAD that has to be addressed because it is part of the wetland that they are delineating. And so until they address that with us and answer all our questions, on that, we can't issue, we can't make a decision, except to deny. And I think Art was supposed to review the new plan as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was. Good. Make sure it's correct. Okay. Right. So all right, we so we, vote, we, we, we voted on that. We denied it. Did we make it? Did that, um... Yeah, we voted, it? right? You moved the vote? I did a yes. second. You did vote. Okay. Yeah. So deny the ANRAD. Now we need to deal with the violation. So at this point, what was, this is what you wanted him, this is the cease and desist, yeah. the enforcement, enforcement order. order. Yeah. So we need this modified to say, to include our bylaws at the top. Mm -hmm. And then we need it mailed out. Is there not an option for a local bylaw? Anywhere on that? Huh? Local bylaw. Mm -hmm. Is there a place to check applicability? It? No. Um, is there a, I don't think there is. Is there enforcement? That enforcement order, order is associated with the Wetland Protection Act regulations. So it's yeah. their yeah. form. It's their form. Yeah, but they have it on our. I, we used to type in and the Douglas Wetland well, Bylaw. We do that. <laughs> we haven't been doing that? Nope. <laughs> well, no. What, for enforcement so requests for an order for of the, conditions. Um, request for order of no, conditions. And for the Douglas Wetland Bylaw. It should be somewhere in the form. Okay. Okay. One of the check marks. All right, so they should form. have it. We okay, the activity has been, is being conducted in an area subject to protection under yada, 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 or in the buffer zone in violation of an issuing authority approval. Are we an issuing authority? Mm -hmm. yeah, so we're going to get a we didn't do an approval of anything, though. Oh. Well, in violation of an issuing, <laughs> that would be violation no, 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 not no. getting yeah. it. Like, <laughs> no, like no. A notice of an order of conditions. Yeah, correct. Yeah. There is no order of conditions. Or negative determination of applicability. Okay. Uh, the order of conditions expired. The activity violates provisions of the COC. The activity is outside the area subject to protection, but has been altered. But has an altered. Okay, no. Uh, other, that's what we can do. You can add that. Because it does both. It, yeah. Well, no, you guys are saying that it has to be already in order of conditions. Mm -hmm. You can do other, which is Douglas bylaws. But I think that you're, I think you're fine because. The activity is being conducted in an area subject to protection under. That's it. Mm -hmm. You guys said no. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one. No, you said um, enforcement and issuing approval. Or something. the buffer zone in violation of an issuing uh, authority approval. But the first part is the activity has been or is being conducted in under an area subject to protection under. Wetlands Production Act. C-131, Section 40. They're not in violation of our approval. I didn't say approval. Says I said being conducted in an area yeah. subject to. Subject to protection. This is an or statement. You don't need to be in this one. Mm -hmm. As long as you're in this one. 
Is that the beginning of that finding? So I, if I check this off, and I check this off and say, and But then it goes on to say, the when your order of conditions and the date. It says or. Or. What's the first Douglas one? Douglas Town Bylaws. Did you, Brenda, did you read the first one in the findings, section B? I, I would agree with that statement, but the first chart. No, I didn't. I okay. missed that. The All activity right. is being conducted in an area subject to protection under. Actually, it looks the same. I'm having, uh, hold on, I haven't figured out how it's different. 131, section 40 might be a wetland. No, it looks exactly, it looks like. One says there is no approval, right? The first or one Or the buffer says zone, which is different than the wetland. A resource area. Yeah, that says that on this one too, though. They both say that. Hold on. The activity has been, is been, being conducted in an area subject to protection, 13140, or the buffer zone. Ah, oh, there you go. That's because this is the without approval, whereas mm -hmm. this one was in violation of yeah. approval. Thank you. Yes. And this is where we can then That's add right. the addition. So we have it checked off here. That's right. But we can also check off here and add your Douglas Town Bios. Okay. So you check that one thing or several And places? plus other Douglas uh, I checked The bylaw. one thing was already checked off by Art. Can you write in Douglas bylaw where you want it? She, yeah, yeah, we did. did. And then there's an, and there's an other checkbox, and I checked that and put Douglas Town Bylaw. Okay. So this is so the yeah, approved. So, you come in and sign it. Is, does it have a signature? It has a signature page. Yes. Well, we better sign it tonight. Mm -hmm. You can sign sure, the last it's a one and I'll stick the. I'll just modify the other one. Yeah. Wow. Oh, so what? Behind. What is the fine? Hmm. We haven't gotten there yet. We no. haven't this gotten is there yet. This is just the system. It's just that they have to stop by such and such a date, which was, I still haven't put it on there yet. Oh, um, yeah, we need to put that. March, we'll f March 1st, yeah. they need to. <laughs> yeah. 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 All right, so what are we doing about fines? Well, well the fines don't in. start mm -hmm. until they March don't 1st. Get, okay. Yeah, this is our paper trail that we're finally starting. This is what we talked about it. doing last time. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so March 1. <coughs> Thank you. Date goes. Table tops have obviously been used in a classroom. <laughs> I used to sit at this desk. It was in the really? library where uh, Suzanne Kane's you office is. Just messaging that me? was a library, and this used to be the, the library desk. Wow. 1973. All right, so that's. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, onward. Public hearing continuation for 66 Southwest Main Street. Milton Moda. This has been continued since when? Anyone? Anyone? Um, I think it was the At same. Least, right? The same, you think? Whoop, that was what, October? No, November 13, you think? The fourth. The summer. Oh, four. thank you. Yeah. That was last time. Yeah. I need to start using highlight. Oh, typed up, but owed taxes. And... Town Treasurer. Taxes on this lot are up to date? No. And what is the date on this? And there was a, a more recent one, um, which we had to submit to the planning board for their application. Right. 12 4. 12 4. An agreement? That was 12 up to date. Huh. She didn't write anything. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, and you thought, didn't bring in a copy of that? No, they, it was one in the folder and uh, Lance gave it to the planning board because they needed it for their application. Mm -hmm. It should be right up there. Did we open this? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I think that was the only thing left was the taxes, and then there was a question about the, the, the storm water at the entrance the and the driveway was cutting. It says taxes paid. What oh. do you think? Yeah. <laughs> yeah no, I think that's okay. a sign. It's very authoritative. <laughs> it's in all caps. And red ink. Yeah. It's got to be official. Right? Yeah, you know, <laughs> you know who. All right. You know who wrote that, right? I'm only guessing who, wrote some, who writes in caps. <laughs> okay. So. No. <laughs> taxes are paid. And that was all? Yes, we it, needed? there was some discussion about the, the entrance, um, but we, I guess we agreed that it was outside the buffer zone, but we were still going to do oh, something yes. about it. So um, we did have, we talked to the, the owner, and he had a contract to go out and build up a, a berm behind the waddles that were already in out there. Um, okay. And that was something Bill Cundiff had also asked us to do is, when he goes to build the driveway, make sure the driveway slopes up before it slopes down so it doesn't take in any more water from the street. Oh. But we have no jurisdiction over that. Right. So. Oh. Anybody I here for that? that. Here for that? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yes, I think the situation was remedied for the driveway, right? They, right. they were out there. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Okay, so we just need uh, to um, close. Yeah, I move that we issue an order of conditions and close the public hearing. Second. Motion been made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay, that's the second. Thank Great. you. All right, thank We're you. We're doing that. Thank you. Have a good night. All right, thank you. Do you need this? Yeah. I hope you can have that. Okay. Would you like this one? Sure. Okay. No revisions. Okay. Huh? And this it. is that one, so we may as well sign that. Oh, and they're continuing. 58 chestnut. Yeah. Ooh. And then the other one is too. 815. And 830 didn't stop filling something. And 845 didn't fill in anything. You get to wait till the end. 930. You can sit down. Nine, nine, <laughs> nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. <laughs> um, so the lopes, did they ask for a continuum? I don't get anything, you know, unless Marie's got something in the files. Then how do you know they're continuing? We met them on site, discussed oh. it with the homeowner. Oh, okay. And, uh, I mean, there's everything's frozen now, so we decided, we told them to come back in the springtime. Brandy and I had a schedule oh. on site visit. Because I know like, that uh, we were Wednesday yeah. at mid-morning. We, we checked things we out. We needed a new plan. That's what I put. We needed a new plan with what? new flagging, right? Yes. You're talking about Linden? Yeah. Okay. All right. And we did request a new plan with the, the limits of where the um, disturbance, where things were going to grow back, and then where he could plant the, you know. Oh, I remember you were planting the about lawn. It was like um, right off of the road. Y you were concerned about if they needed to pull some back. Mm -hmm. And now, yeah. what did you think Hello. when you yeah. went out there? Well, so first off, are we going to have this tonight, or are they not? He, he's not going to come in. I don't think they're going to. Well, come if in. you're going to talk about it, wait to open. All right. Exactly. That's okay. what I was. Yeah, I've got a whole. I, I wrote down everything we talked to him about. Oh, okay. So, all right. I would probably continue it to the March. March. Or tell him to come in. <laughs> I don't know if we were well, clear. Are we sure that he's not coming in tonight? It's not time. Not, I mean, we're, oh, we're oh, they oh, didn't oh, ask for a continuance. Oh, yeah. How do we get yeah. on this? Uh, oh, because <laughs> oh, okay. she said, how do you know that Lopes isn't coming in tonight? Oh. 
Because you were like, we don't have this, we don't have that, we don't have this. <laughs> Nobody's coming in. Yeah, okay. Like, we're going to play Parcheesi. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what time is I am so we tired. we got a couple minutes. I understand. I understand. So we're just waiting right. for 7.59 at the moment. That's what we are counting down to. We have four Okay, more we signed the vouchers. Well, good, the 9th, 15th, and 15th people Yeah, here. RDA. Yep. Oh, good. 73. Oh, good, good. Ledstone good. Road? Yep. yep. Okay, we can um, take you out of water. We can take you right now. Sounds good. Oh, okay. All right, come on up. Come on down. So this is a request for determination of applicability, <laughs> public <laughs> meeting. <laughs> 73 <laughs> Ledstone Road, Joan Steele. Yep. That's my mom. We're here to represent her. Okay. How's it going? Good. So good, how are you? And if you could introduce yourself for the record. I'm Mara Burgess, her daughter. And I'm um, Pete Burgess, his son-in-law. Okay. Welcome. And if you have a plan, Steve, do you have any pictures? I have pictures on I'm yep. trying to get them. Okay. All right, so what are you proposing? So we're proposing a garage um, to be built on the property, at the top of our property, um, on Ledgestone Road. Okay. And the garage would be 32 feet by 40 feet. And um, it's kind of like in the middle of the property. A driveway kind of runs around the edges of it. Um, I believe he has pictures of it. Okay. Um, uh, yeah. Oh, Brandy can see that. Yeah. Okay. So. Point out so it's in the middle. Yes, so if you turn it like this so Steve can see too. Um, the house is down there. This is the middle where it's going to be built. There is a driveway that comes all the way up and around and back out. It's in the middle of the circle. Right. Yeah. 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 yeah, thank you. Yep. So it's going in the center of the driveway, kind of loops down. Yep. That the stream is on the right it's side. Over in here. Um, is all the wall, the road, more more land and everything, and then the stream is. Can okay, I see it's very right, <coughs> right about here? It flows down, so it's 70 feet when I measured it with the wheel mm -hmm. to about the center of where they're putting a the barn. So it's on the other side of the driveway, the woods. Intermittent. Intermittent. So, um, are you going to be bringing in any um, fill or digging? Where is it? You're going to have a stockpile? Yes, area? and we will It'll keep be behind this. that. With a, on the opposite side of the driveway, we. So, if you go back um, to maybe <coughs> top view, like up in here. Okay. So. Just yeah. So right there. Okay. So across from here, this driveway is going exiting back out so the stockpile will be yeah, over and we here. also own the, the <coughs> land next to it so we can use that too so yeah. and, the, and this view the stream is on the right hand side right the stream is over in like here and running mm -hmm. down okay. mm -hmm. i can't see it yeah so. down there. <laughs> yeah and how much do you need to excavate is it's it just going to be in that one area right there yeah, yeah. quantity wise right. how deep just for, the, gonna, <coughs> just, just for the foundation. Just for the foundation. I, they'll probably bring in some fill to put in the inside when they do the foundation mm -hmm. to bring it up even with the driveway. So it'll be like a slab? Right. Yeah. Okay. So it's not going to be a big hole? No. Nope. Okay. Nope. It's going to be here um, 32 by 40, and it fits right in that area. And like you said, they'll we'll stockpile up in here. But a, a driveway for it, is it? Dri this oh, is the driveway. That we, oh, okay. We'll just attach yeah. to that driveway. Yep. How far is the water about, on about the other 70 side of the driveway feet. from? From the building. The and so, building. Yeah, yeah, that's what you say. I, I wheeled it's, it about yeah. 70. Was there a plan submitted, plot plan, with the application? Well, the building permit. Yeah. His application. Mm -hmm. uh, those drawings. These are drawings here. Um, we also went so to. We kind of need to make sure that we know where everything is in writing. We went to. This is it. <laughs> Mm 
That's all you got. So we know that it's exactly 70 feet, even without any flagging? No. No, it's just a stream. I mean, Steve wheeled it. Yeah. I mean, it dries well, up. It was dries up. Wetlands, it, it, the um, summer's dried you know, up. Buffering. Associated BBW. Vegeta, no. It didn't look like it. It was all rocky. Um, I think it's runoff from the fall. It's spring. exactly what it is. Okay. Yeah. It dries up mm -hmm. usually. It's just that we've had a lot of a lot of legend in that area. Yeah, it's yeah. the there stream. Is. Yep, and I also pulled this from the um, Water it. Health. She gave us our plans and everything. Okay, show that. So we'll uh, yeah, take a look at the that. assessors. You can't yeah. really. Yeah, go we went by to the that. assessors. We went to the Board of Health. So the house is down in here. The garage. Just put is it over here. Yep. And you can. Uh -oh. They're both the same. <laughs> one just shows you more. Yeah, one shows you a little bit more. She just kind of widened it out there. Here's the stream. Yep. And the the garage is going where? Okay. Get my bearings. Okay, so this is the home right here. So up here um, at the top, and the stream it comes down in here. So from here to here is like 70 feet. We'll be nowhere near here at so all. So where's the garage going? You right garage. here. Where your septic uh -huh. is? No, 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 it's above. No, it's above. It's right above. Reserve. That's a reserve area. We I can don't put a barn on top, a garage on top of that? No, you have to put that reserve area somewhere else. So I'm sorry, show me in here. Where's the... That's This is the reserve, reserve area. Garage. It's a septic. I put no garage over it. I mean, that's not our big deal. Right. But Nothing to do with us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And like you said, the stream is over here. So anything we use will be over here and on this piece of property if we have to store anything that's taken out of there. Do, they don't need board of health approval for a, a garage. Well, I think they sign off anyway on yeah, the green sheet. Yeah, that's true. Mm -hmm. Because if they put plumbing, bathroom or something, they want to know what you're doing on there. It's just going to be a car garage? It's, it's a, a car, car garage. There will be no bathroom. Yeah. But they are... They should do sign off on the building permit. Yeah, go to they're going to want yeah. another area for a reserve area. So they might the move failed. it. They might have to move it. You I think? don't know. I don't know either. I'm not supposed to put anything in the, it has to be, this reserve area needs to be clear of any structure. Have you gone to Board of Health or is this your first board you've been to? Um, no, we have not gone to okay. Board of Health. <clears throat> We're in because if we're I'm thinking, think we, if were had, we were into, we came to conservation, mm -hmm. we went to the assessors, um, we checked on all the taxes and everything, and then, yeah. yes, we did go to Board of Health. This is where the Board of Health came from. Mm -hmm. did, yeah, copies. but you just asked for a plan. You didn't tell them what you were doing. No, yeah, we did. Oh, okay. We spoke to the girl in there. Oh. Yeah, but it didn't go before the board. It's different between going to the office and asking somebody in the office and actually being before, like you're before this board exactly. now. Yeah. yeah. No, so they have explained. not. They have not voted on. They have no. not voted on this. And so no. what I guess we're saying is that it is unlikely that it's going to pass. Not that we can speak to it because it's mm. not our jurisdiction, but that from ex the voice of experience is saying that they are unlikely to approve slapping a garage on top of this. Expansion. You need area. to relocate this and just say it's 10 feet from the trench. But if anything, they'd probably have to move it further away from the stream. Because that know. looks like it's the only yeah. area. Yeah. Well, not as. <coughs> only if the other board votes the way we right. think they're right. probably yeah. going yeah, to. That's vote. the only spot we can put it. So. And unfortunately, okay. that's what leads me to say that this requires an RD. <coughs> because I don't know what the well, other that's board what it is, is going to. She meant to say I'm saying that I think that yeah. they need to file. Sorry. Oh, what I'm saying is that because I need to know what that other board votes before I can tell you whether I approve this, because I don't think it's actually going to stay there. So well, now we're getting into needing a paper trail, and that's what the filing allows is for us to follow the progress of this through the various steps of the of the process. Well, this well, can be this area is uh, fictional for the future. It's you can move this area. It needs to be relocated somewhere that's right. suitable. Right. But you could say, if they keep it exactly in this spot, <coughs> we can approve. Well, you can, you can just continue the RDA and get board out of approval. Yeah. Yeah, because when we spoke to them, and like I said, we didn't go before our board, but we spoke to them and explained it, and she gave us the plans and... Yeah, yeah, not, not the, the same thing. But for us to make them file with Board of Health, which is what we do if we help them up, 
No, I'm not saying file anything. It needs to be reviewed by the board health yeah. agent. I'm just saying that that's there for a reason. In mm -hmm. case your septic system fails, that is a designated area. Well, no, and, and I also don't think it's it's not nothing to say that you're bringing in fill and you're stockpiling it somewhere. So we need erosion controls. We need to know that that stockpile is where the proposal well, is. Well, there's not going to be any stockpile. With the, if they bring in anything, it's going to go right into the foundation yeah. area. Because it's the only... Well, the dirt that's coming out, unsuitables. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I prefer there's to see more detail, like a, a survey plan showing you know, this distance, because this is actually showing that there is a BBW here. Yeah. There's a center line of the stream, and then the bank is here. You've got 57 feet to the edge of the existing driveway, and then plus this. And then you've got to be, your distance is from the trenches. Could you just explain that because I'm not understanding what you just said. We just want it drawn on here like if you're going to not stockpile anything it needs to say no stockpiling on site. Or if you're going to do a stockpile area like outside the 100, figure out what the 100 foot buffer is and put it outside there. Like say if you has, have a designated area that you're going to put it at. Right, well, we'll well, stop, we own the house. So I'll nothing. stock it on, on anything that's going to be stocked will go on my property. Our yeah. property is 75 which abuts. Yeah. My mom's at 73, which this is going on. So that would not be a problem. Because we're side by side. So you want a, a, a stamped plan? I want so. something with more detail. Okay. If you're going to do an RDA mm -hmm. and not do a full blown filing, it needs to have, you know, some sort of showing where the stream is. This doesn't even tell me this is a stream. The 75 feet, 80 feet, what did you think it was? It's 70, I 70 agree. feet. We so maybe you would use point. this plan? Yeah, that shows everything. Okay. And show the <coughs> stockpile site. Well, yeah, I don't think okay. you'll have any trouble even off the outside the 100 on the same property. Well, the property's 100 feet wide. Yeah, so if you land 70 here, 30 more feet, you're in this area right here. If is that wooded pile. or is that open? Um, so it's be. both. Um, like I said, that 73 and it's my mom's, who we're here to represent, 75 is ours. So there is open area there, even got to be probably 100, 150 feet from the stream because that's further away. That's as you first ride in. I don't know if you recall, Steve, as you first drive in to the, on the right of way. So that that's go? the first. There's two houses and then my mom's with the driveway coming around. So we have that whole open area. I don't know if you realized when you were coming in there on the left where anything could go that would be. And it's, as far as Board of Health is concerned, what do you want to receive from them, from the board help. Well, I could always make a determination on what they're saying now, and if they can't put it there, then they'd have to come back. But it needs to they be have exact to be locations, yeah. But that's not what you were saying. Yeah, I would. I mean, I would be more comfortable since we are. If you're talking about granting a negative RDA, then in that case I'd want to know that it is in fact going to be approved where they're asking for it to be. It's very, very different. With with us granting an RDA, we're, we're losing a lot of our paper trail. And so for that, that's why we're asking for there being more on this plan, because this plan becomes the end-all be-all of what we have as an agreement as far as what will and won't be done. So, you know, not only where is the stockpile and the distances, the erosion control, there would have to be erosion control. Well, can I just interrupt and say we built the house at 75. Um, Steve was involved in that. We adhered to everything that was asked of us. There was never a problem. There were people up there monitoring and watching it all the time. So, so if I, you put those stipulations in. Did you file originally? A for 75? Yeah, we built a whole See addition. how that's different because that's an actual no, filing. Yeah. So what we're so what I'm trying to say here is that 
for us to grant you not to have to file. What you present to us has to be so solid that we feel comfortable enough not doing all the paperwork because what you, the paperwork you've provided now has everything we need to know need to know so that we can all it's on paper in writing that's the way that you can get us to say okay you know what you don't need to do all the rest of the filing paperwork because we can see everything we need to see right here the problem is right now this isn't quite there and there's a possibility well if you if you approve this and they don't we can't go nowhere anyway so right but there's even more besides the board of health that we need on this before it's for as far as i'm concerned there's more that needs to be on there before it can be, it can serve as in lieu of filing. Does that make yeah, sense? Yeah, giving us evidence that we can make a determination. Yeah. yeah, we need we need it all to be on paper more than just, it's good to explain it, but it also has to be on paper, in writing, like on so the this, paper. So this plan does show um, erosion control, siltation fence actually, way back when. Well, was back placed then, on this. But that's right. I need to know that it's but part of the current proposal. And what plan would you like to see? We don't want to see this. Well, right? there would no. So there needs to be something close to the this. Original plan. But then there needs to yeah. be a a written narrative on here. In other words, things that say "propose" here that now exist that needs you need to change that. It can't say "proposed house." Mm -hmm. It has to say this is now the existing house. Uh, you know what I mean? This plan has to reflect the work that will be done. It can't say things that aren't applicable. Do you know what I mean? Correct. So, and and draw the new the new erosion control where it's it gonna right where be. it is. That's great. Then you can say this will be the erosion control that yeah. we'll use. Uh, <coughs> Do you have the original full full plan? I would say my Way mom back. would have everything. That is the original. And that is the original. No, this is just a piece of yeah. an original plan. Christine made a copy. Well, yeah, Christine they made have a copy when we were here. They have the 24 by 36. Yeah. 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 They can make a copy in the Right. She just gave us the she pieces gave us that of it to show. Just small just to show. Because that obviously way, that's for when my parents built the house back in the day and it's just showing you and she thought it would be extremely helpful for us to bring that to this meeting tonight. And it's helpful for the yeah. discussion. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. But this is closer to what we need than this, which is missing a lot of information. But we also need the part of the plan that is up in here, which is actually closer well, one, to the One screen. shows more than the other, yeah. which she made. I don't know if that's on the it. other yeah. one there. But she right. does have the ability to make you a full plan. She did, and she offered that, oh. but okay. we weren't sure what we would need, so yeah. we just grabbed those. Somebody else actually came in and helped her make them that day. And we have the plans from yeah. the builder. That does, so the stream gray. does come around. Yeah. It's 83 to the edge of the trench. And the so fence did go on the other side of the yep. driveway. Yep, and we had to use fencing in, in the case of when we built the house, we had mm -hmm. to use straw versus hay because we're on the lake. So I'm on the board for straw the Straw versus hay? One, I can't remember which one. It's yeah. one versus the other because you're on the lake. And I'm on the pond the association, straw. so. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what we use. I'm extremely yeah. careful about what I do up there. So we want the full version of this plan. Okay. Let me write that down. Go ahead, Mike. It's 87 to the edge of the... 83. 83. Mm-hmm. But the, the structure they're building, is that what they're trying to represent here? Mm-hmm. Well, I don't think words, they've the actually field, tried to represent it. No, nothing yet. is represented they need to do on that. Them. I'd say take a nice bright color marker. I actually don't need a full plan. This it, this one's better because it does have the yeah. So. yeah she I opened one more than the other for yeah, us. Yeah, I could use this one. Yeah. But what we need is this plan now marked up in a way that we can see exactly where you're putting what you want to put. Like use a purple marker or something or a red marker. Because basically in the middle of the, a, it's a circular driveway. It's going in the middle of a circle driveway. I hear you, but that's the not. The question readable. is how far is it from the street? That's not on this plan. S Seventy so feet. Basically. Use this plan. That's been measured by us and also because by it, it shows more of the wetland here, where this yeah. one cuts it off. So I don't use this one. No okay. good. So this is Everything's not a proposed house anymore. It is the house. All right. And you want to draw in exactly where the garage is going to be. Not yeah, not so freehand. I mean, we're really talking about figure out where exactly it's going to be. Measure be sure you know forty by and make it put it on the plan so that because that's kind of like the contract of saying, okay, we're not going to have to file a full notice of intent because this is the new contract so we need to know exactly where that is going and we need to know exactly where the proposed stockpile will be 
We need to know exactly yeah, where you're going to put your... Yeah, just in the stream. We need that's, to know that's, that's where it's near well, the stream. It's happened before. Yeah. So that's yeah, why we're, we're on a hill. It right. It's going yeah. down the hill. It ain't I going am, in the stream. Yeah. But we can't sideways. tell that from a piece of <laughs> paper flat. here unless it's on a piece of paper like that that's got, for example, the topo lines on. Yeah. Yeah. Well, like we can't I have two options. I can put it up here or I can put it over on the property at 75. So you tell me which no, the board is more comfortable with and I can see that that happens. I don't know. Outside the 100 foot is not our jurisdiction. Yeah, so you could do anything you want. You could put it out it's there. It's from this line right yeah. here. Over 100, 100 feet. feet. 100. Okay, yeah. so yeah. then that's either spot yeah. that we can put yeah. it in would be optional. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the stockpile, the erosion control, and the placement of your garage. Those are the three most important things. Okay, we're all set board. We'll continue, continue this until our next meeting, which is not until February 5th. Another month gone. Yeah. <laughs> At what time, Steve? I'm crazy. Two months now. All right, so I take this back and the other paperwork. 7.30, did you say? Yeah. Need yeah, that, that one. If we're able to draw this, this, this up one. before our 9.30 original meeting, is that applicable for tonight or? Oh, so you want us to continue this discussion until later in the meeting? Is that what you're saying? Is that the possibility? I would appreciate yeah. that. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. Okay. Thank All you. right. Yeah, I appreciate that. Uh, so, do your homework. <laughs> get, <laughs> get, get a ruler and a protractor. Go to work. Okay. But I, so it's, it's better if you have the stockpile on your property there well, than on that other that's property. Where be, that's okay. where it will be because right. I have two options. Because then we'd say, well, now we need that other plan All right. of the other property. No. Okay, thank you. Thank you. All right, so we're going to continue this public meeting. Postpone. We, postpone. Yeah, we don't even need to postpone. say anything. We just took them early. True. All right. Um, Which one are we 759 at? we were 759? waiting for. Yeah. We just took a Oh, all right. Yeah. Okay, that's a public so southwest meeting. Yeah. Public meeting. And then we can jump it's if we want. Well, we can jump to the 50 no, just now. Which is continued, so we might as well get that off the books. So, you're saying do the motion to 59? Motion to continue 58 Chestnut Street to March 5th, 2018 at 7 p.m. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Who was the date on it's, it's written right on there, under 8 o'clock. So it is. What is this one? What time is that? Who are you? <laughs> 32 are you Linden. Here? Are you 32 Which Linden? Oh, no. That was, that that's, it didn't look like the right lot. lot. Oh, I see. It's 7 o'clock. Yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. So oh, zero. We oh, we went to 759. <laughs> well, because it's a public <laughs> meeting, not a yeah. public hearing, so we wanted to get the public hearing done. You were like, that's close to getting it before the people. No, we didn't. Oh, we didn't open it. Yeah, yeah zero so Southwest Main. Um, yeah, we haven't opened it. It's a no, 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 yeah. the 8 o'clock. No, you're on 759 right now. Okay, zero Southwest Main. Derek and Kelly Bean. Is that how you say it, Bean? Yes, sir. Okay. All right, thank you. The Town of Douglas Conservation Commission will hold a public meeting for Derek and Kelly Bean on January 8th at 759 Municipal Center at 29 Depot Street for work to be done pursuant to the Town of Douglas Wetland Bylaw and the Wetland Protection Act, MGL 131, Section 40. Proposed request for determination of applicability work location is 0 Southwest Main Street, and the applicant is requesting permission to, to construct a driveway to a single-family home and associated earthwork within the 100 foot buffer zone. You could introduce yourself. Yes. Travis Brown with Andrew Servan Engineering here on behalf of the applicant Derek and Kelly Bean. Uh, this is currently an address at 0 Southwest Main Street. Um, we're proposing to construct a single family house uh, back in this location, a private septic system and a private well. Uh, for reference, Southwest Main Street is here. Our access point to the lot is in this location. Um, across the street on the other side of the pavement there's this wetland um, that was flagged and then uh, surveyed located 
Um, 50 foot buffer is here and the 100 foot buffer is here. So we're proposing to pave uh, the first 20 to 25 feet of that driveway. Uh, the rest of it will be reground asphalt in there. Um, we're coming in in this location just because grade wise it sets up uh, better than potentially up the street where there's a pretty good slope coming up into the lot. Um, we're gonna have minimal grading here. Um, we show this tree line coming up. So that'll be just kind of the swath for the driveway location. Uh, proposed erosion control barrier, we're gonna put some straw wattle on the downslope side. Uh, we've also called for straw wattle to be laid across that uh, entrance at the end of each workday just to prevent any potential runoff going into Is that noted Street. on the plan? Yes, it is. Straw wattle to be placed Not across the driveway. Can you bring that plan up a little <laughs> closer? Under the light, too, is better. Sure. Thanks. So that that is what we'll do as far as erosion control, anything getting into the street. Uh, as you can see, the majority of the work is outside the 100-foot buffer up on the hill uh, to this lot here. Yeah. Any French country drainage in the street or swales or anything around this? No, no, there's not. Just crown, like uh, most roads in Douglas, and just mm -hmm. more Nothing runs on down side. each side. No. See, did you watch this? I did. It's, completely the new. it's the last, it's like the last lap before the uh, state, state forest. forest. Yep. Okay. So this is all state forest. It's all high. Right it's here. all. I don't have any issues with it. They call that There's a street in, in between it. Mm -hmm. Across the street. There's Across a what? The street. There's okay. a street. <laughs> oh, you're talking about with the. Yeah. Where he stopped it's to drink water on his way through town. Really? Is this a completely new driveway or is there like a path there now? Or There's something? nothing there. Nothing. It's all no, wooded. It's, it's all a wooded wood. lot. Yep. It's all high. I mean, it's elevated. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It but climbs up the hill and then it kind of plateaus here and then it actually goes off down the hill to the back. Hmm. So this is a the wetland itself is a low area too. It is, it's yeah, across the street. Uh, I, I think it's, it's part isolated. of a BVW. Yeah, it wraps yeah. around. It's the... I can't picture where this is. I know, I'm having really trouble. I'm going to grab this. Sure. Because so, I'm having trouble with the same forest. So, as you go past Bad Luck Pond... So here's Bad Luck Pond. Pond. There's one. Yeah, here's Bad Luck Pond. Yeah. You get a couple of sharp corners. <laughs> then there's a gate. Can you feel entrance. it? Swoosh, swoosh. Yeah. Cowboy Rock on the left. Cowboy what? Rock? Cowboy Rock? And George Washington's what is this spring. This thing right there. George Washington's mm -hmm. what? Spring. Oh. There's a cup oh, hanging there. Oh, yeah. Right yeah. Oh. Are you serious? What it used to be there like? was. Look at this. Like a copper cup. What's that? No, it was a plastic one. It's a path. Stuff. Is that what that is? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't know. George Washington There's mentioned it in Emerson's. Yeah, but this one is different. Time. You see the. The Douglas was a desolate town. Nothing but rock. And he continued on his way so to Hartford. Basically, you're seeing the edge of this wetland. <laughs> yeah, we'll I was just surprised we're not seeing so it. You went to Putnam Tavern. Yeah, where's yeah. Um, Cedar, Cedar Swamp? Cedar Swamp. There's nothing up here. Cedar. Right here? No. This house Cedar. is to the. There's a, house, there's a neighbor. And, and this is that the wrong side? Yeah, so there is, there's a neighbor here, and then there's a house no, here. The, house the Cedar Swamp swings right yeah, yeah. here. And yeah. so I'm just trying to figure out what's the distance. It looks like there. it's touching yeah. the edge of, on your Yeah, on site. here. Oops. You might have been a little bit wild with that, that those hash marks. Because mm -hmm. your corner there touches the seat. You have GIS yeah, you know on your laptop, was, Steve, or you can't get in. Huh? Your laptop, back. you have GIS? Oh, all the From way back off the page. And then it got cut, and it was actually a piece that was conveyed to the state. Okay. To the state so this well. would be shorter. Yes, you're saying? this parcel I get okay. conveyed out to the state. Okay. Have the map and parcel number. Yeah, map two twenty eight parcel three. Steve is going to bring up some. Hopefully, as long as no dirt ends up in the street, I'm fine with us. We're good. Well, let's double check here. Good question. Now I do too. I'm fading fast. Can we call it Native, even though this. Native? 
Negative. Oh. <laughs> even though. <laughs> All right, so what do you got, Steve? This is a, this is a parcel. Oh, even a hundred. I think the swamp's way over here. Yeah, I'm doing 50, but no bells. It's on a street. Can you show wetlands on the floor? No, I don't. I don't. I didn't know whether there was a uh, technicality here because mm. it's an RDA mm. rather than a final. Lots of friggin' lights on that laptop. Nice. See how that's all light green up in there? Isn't that wetland? Mm -hmm. But when did this it get conveyed? For the state. You know? What's that? When did the land get conveyed? This other parcel? Long time ago? Yeah, probably, well, not that long, probably 10 years. Oh, yeah, but you can see, the, go, you can go, see go. the whole lot is between it and the, oh, and the swamp. Oh, so yeah. okay. yeah. it's yeah. deceiving. We're good. Okay, thank you, Steve. Do you have other questions, Linda? No. Nope. Oh. Thank you. The only issue I have. Yes. I have one. Huh? Is the street address. Zero. I know. I don't like calling them zero any more than you, but it's we asked the building department, we asked the assessor. He's not going to. We've not. We've five not to had. ten years from now, it's awful difficult to yep, mm -hmm. I agree. find the file. I agree. We try well, to get these addresses, but. Well, why don't we get right? a number before we give you the negative uh, paperwork? you got to get us the number. I mean, you're going to need a number. Yeah, I, mean, I assume anyway, once he tries to pull a building permit that they'll issue a number, but I just yes. don't I don't think they're going to do That's it before That's the only that. way you do it. He doesn't do it for our no. ANRs? Mm -hmm. Nope. No, well, we don't even have anything to sign here. I mean, mm. we can, I'll give them a call and see if yeah, they I can. Yeah, Zandel used to have the, uh, the master plan. Yeah. And, you know, what's the neighbor's address? Three, 59. 59. Are you going to try to make a number? No, no, but usually if, if the neighbor, so it's going to be close. If there's 59. 500, if there's 1,000 feet, they'd skip, you know, 50 numbers, street numbers right. to allow for right. the future A&Rs. Yep. So it should be relatively easy for him to grant it's, it since you have a butter. Yeah, and it's been submitted to Board of Health, so assuming that they approve it and then oh, yeah. building yeah. department may issue one at that point. So... But he can put the application in and get a number without getting it issued, the permit issued. I mean, you can sign it as long as you, you know, when you get the building permit, before I sign off on it, Yeah. I'll update the okay. file. Paperwork. That's fine. Even the but septic the, plan is the title zero. 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 So yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And I think whenever you file, it's the RDA by applicant anyways. I move that we issue a negative RDA. Second. And close the public meeting. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you very Aye. much for your time. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Uh, no, so we don't need a street number. Oh, Ava needs it. Yes. <laughs> she was talking disparagingly <laughs> about you, no show. There's lots of snow. He's going to come no matter what. So we continue at 8 o'clock already. So there. So we're on to 8.15. We have a continuation of a public mm -hmm. hearing for 32 Linden Street, Corey and Natalia Lopes. Hi. Hi. Good. How are you? All right. So last time we met, we had a site visit. Mm -hmm. And I was told to go to the Department of Health to get an ASBO plan, mm -hmm. and then right on the ASBO plan, how we're going to proceed. Mm -hmm. No ASBO plan. <laughs> From the Board of Health, nothing? No file? <laughs> At all. Oh, boy. Right. <laughs> so I called earlier to see what I could do so I didn't waste anyone's time. And they said, just let you guys know what's going on. You know. Hmm. Uh, so they didn't have any file on you at all? They had a file. Oh, they had the plan you know, that we've been ASBO. staring at for the last couple of months. I see. So, yeah. I mean, my house, I don't even have an ASBO. Mm -hmm. I've been there since 78. Mm. So, so, yeah. So now I was just wondering. I, I have no problem doing that on a plan, but I just don't know what you guys want me to I need to be assured that what's shown on this, you can use this plan, but we need some sort of markers on what is out there right. if it's a true story or not yeah and that's what your issue was before, yeah if you don't get you like this well i'm not gonna anything, right? yeah. yeah so you want to know if the house is in the right place and all that stuff or? yeah and then the wetlands mm -hmm. if they're in the right place 
So you want reflagging? No. I don't need over. I need just like just that section. Yeah. yeah. Like well, here. in the back, because it, it was this whole area was grubbed out. But Wasn't there it? are wetland flags out there, and so I what we're trying to do is deal with fixing the violation. Mm -hmm. And so we can work from the wetland flags outward without the, I think, without the as built. Which um, is fine. I, I measured a little bit too. So we're we trying. were talking, you know, we know where this wetland flag here is. And okay. there's a tree right here. And so, right about there. And so we were talking about the fact that the fill goes within, like, right up within five feet of this. Mm -hmm. And so I have here more than a foot and a half of fill up to five feet of the wetland flag. My recommendation was uh, pull back some fill. And plant. Right? Loosen the soil. Pull back tw at least 25 to 30 feet. That'll loosen the soil and then seed with native mix and fix some of the bales where they're breaking down, add some bales where there aren't any, and yeah, in yeah. a straight line. Fix the controls you said. In a straight line that. from the road out to the, sh there's a road, a tree, and a rock by the shed. And if you do a straight line there and pull it back 25 or 30 feet, I don't know, whichever one you guys want, 25, 30, whatever. Mm -hmm. um, and if he just pulls it back enough to really um, not pull, like you're not going to pull all foot and a half of that fill out, but if you pull enough of it to really scarify the soil so that the seeds will take, mm -hmm. to take in it, then we could have a nice 25 or 30 foot buffer created by him. And then uh, he would fix a couple of the bales that are kind of pooping out. Okay, is it bales or waddles? Yeah, waddles. waddles. Yeah. yeah. And then we okay. I was told we're going to put bales where we There are a couple of bad places yeah. where it's channelizing. So we're going to put bales and lift the waddles up, which I lifted the waddles Some of the waddles up. are smushed, so mm -hmm. we just resurrect them. And then I was just going to plan, and at this point I'm going to do So <laughs> let's, so for relativity, I think if you pull 25 feet from every single one, yeah, and and or stay within that the tree the rock the shed thing do you, yeah do you know what i'm if referring to yeah, oh yeah i remember rock, tree if rock can, okay if you can pull that and then have that revegetate or we're going to seed 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 with native seed mix if you could just show a, me a wetland I, seed mix yes yeah, steve here. can help you find that yeah and yeah Easy. oh buffer zone okay. so just just yeah. it should be a buffer because buffer, it's Buffers. we're not turning it yeah. into a wetland yeah. so yeah okay. and okay. you want to see it drawn on a plan I would want to see it. Yeah, that was the yeah. Rigid, that's you what gotta I use this plan. That's but the only plan. Yeah, but you need to actually put on the dimensions for us, the actual ones versus like this one says hundred foot buffer. So oh, measure boy, out and measure then the numbers. My driveway to like where the first flag is or something. Is that what you're saying? Well, yeah, flag you guys out. are asking for something different. I'm giving them directions for like that can be written down in the minutes that will say 25 foot from each wetland flag. Uh, extending 25 feet, 30 feet, whatever, or we can say from straight line, rock, tree, rock. I can easily do all that, ver like written out, when I say verbally, I mean, you know, you know, notated, uh, and, and therefore he doesn't need to like submit a new plan. But we would have to all write that all in an order for conditions if I we didn't have a plan. I yes. think a plan is good. I would like it would be well, so much easier to write plan. The problem is, the plan, is plan. that the plan is based on something we don't even know if it's true. Whereas well, what irrelevant. I'm saying is mm -hmm. based on the actual features on the ground because I was there. So I, you know, literally oh. I saw that flag. Mm -hmm. I know where it is. And it's I don't want to play around with a map that we're mm -hmm. not even sure if this is correct. Whereas I can say that flag right there and that rock, that tree, that shed, there should be a straight line of fill raked and seed placed. So, so I mean, I think it's more reliable than a plan. You don't want him to say, okay, here's wetland flag one. I pulled, this is where it lands, 25 feet. And well, we then have I that, pull along. We have that choice. The I think edge. the rock tree rock literally does a 25 to 30 foot pullback 
from all of them. So okay, there's so a single tree in the middle of the oh, one, one giant exactly. big yeah. old tree. Yeah. Yeah. You can't miss it. There's so, no confusing so it. So in the minutes, it rock, would say the only standing tree in the cleared area. Yes. Yeah, and okay. the rocks I'm talking about are giant boulders. They're not getting moved. They can't be moved. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. we're not talking about, you know. So it's the rock by the road to the to the single standing tree to the rock by the shed literally makes a line that's about 25 to 30 feet around that whole thing. I was just doing it for convenience for everybody because uh, at the time I was pacing it all and kind of getting sense of like, I think it would be about here anyways. You know this is an NOI, right? It's not an RDA. So we have oh, to issue No, I was, no, you're right. I was thinking more of just a, uh, of a violation. Uh, yeah, violation. Yeah. So. Cause it is a, uh, you know, you're mentioning rock by the road. I mean, well, like 10 years from now, nobody's going to say which rock by the road. No, you know? your point's taken. I, yeah. m mind you, I don't agree with that because I told you these are glacial rocks that are left. So I don't agree with that. But I get your point that we now, why you want it on a plan makes mm -hmm. more sense. Yeah. So I yeah. can go out 20 years from now or when he sells it, <laughs> you yeah. know, next year. Yeah. <laughs> and then they redo the same thing, you know, um, we can have a plan stating that the applicant remedied the situation by staying, you know, Yeah, but what are your reference points? Because flags can, mm -hmm. wetland flags can be moved. He could, he could measure oh, so you do want to do yeah. that? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. From his house. Yeah. Well, I don't know where the house area. is. I don't know where yeah. the house is. Oh. That's my problem with that. So, yeah, so. But I think if you designate the rock, the tree, and there wasn't there a um, shed? I see what you're saying. Yes, the shed and the shed was here, but the boulder was next to it, and the boulder's not going anywhere. A shed can be moved. Yeah. So that yeah, it would be shed, boulder, tree, rock. Okay, but I get your point. So I would still try to pull some kind of distance, like to from the wetland flag to the rock, so you can put a distance on here for us. I like the distance thing. And the wetland to the tree. Yeah. So I can okay. use this plan. Well, yeah. That was okay. Even yeah. though you think that this may may or may not be correct, but mm -hmm. we will make it correct by measuring in the field. So this is going to be not to scale mm -hmm. anymore. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you want to write the wetland flag numbers okay. on this plan okay. and the distance from that big rock, the distance from the tree. The tree. Give me, you know, ties. Okay. to the flag can the can the rock be penciled in on this yeah. plan oh, oh yeah, yeah. well it yeah. is enough it's not over a circle here for somewhere. the rock a circle for the tree okay. a circle for the other rock and a square for the shed you're good to go and put tree mm -hmm. rock as much information so that pretend you're off shed rock. <laughs> no, no I, I, that's fine i'm like i said i'm just yeah. gonna rake it back plant seed and let it grow so and then on the other side of the 25 to 30 feet we're going to grant him to be able to loam and seed. Maybe yes, on the this side. Yeah. So yeah. I would shade in all the areas. I so mean, this like is going to look shade we in said like a right little here. bit. Yeah. Okay, and then put to the rock. Proposed lawn. Yeah. Rock, the rock, and the then tree tree draw and a line across. Or. And connect yeah. a line and say, I'm going to pull back here. Yeah. <laughs> and then you're going to bullet. First, what I'm going to do is this, right. then this, and this. Okay. Okay. So that nothing kind of erodes back in and yeah. maintain all the erosion control. Okay. I'm sure it's in the notes, too, because they did, had to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. Do I have to make it look like this or just write it? Am I no, just writing it on this? It. Okay. Yeah. Does it show any um, silicon or anything on here? It has the yeah, detail, but, but it, there's no nothing. Nothing. So on like the plan. we'll use nothing. it where we feel oh, like okay. using it. Nothing. So if like when you draw, oh, we've already got the silk fence. Yeah. It's right on the wetland. Yes. Yeah, and it's literally still there. We even call the guaranteed builders. I guess they're the ones that built the house. And they they told me that they don't keep uh, no. records to that that old. Yeah. I even tried calling Do you want to see where the, 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 what the silt fence, the uh, straw wattles are on this plan too? Instead of just where the yeah. wetland flags are? They're already in there mm -hmm. for the they're violation. Yeah. Um, you might want to call these guys. They would have done the as-built plan. Oh, okay. So they mm -hmm. might have something in their computer. I mean, 97 is not that 
far away. I mean, everybody was having electronic records. This one was drawn on a uh, board, but yeah. they may have something scanned in. Okay. Yeah, because I'm going to try it, try it out. So now it's making more sense. You got your, your directions. Mm -hmm. You got a little homework to do, yeah, too. So, um, if they don't have it, I'm good with this all, right? Yes. yes. You need to make accurate measurements in the field. Yes. So whatever is in the field, rock, tree, don't rock. trust anything that's on this plan. <laughs> yes. Okay. Actually, I would like to see also on the plan the straw wattles because those need to be maintained until your project is done. And but there's no they reference. Are there, didn't you just say that it was marked in here? No, it's dash line. No, no that's the B. I oh, thought you said there was. Oh, okay. No, so maybe. That's, um, so you have to draw in. She wants it, the erosion control where it's located. Where you are. Yeah, so slightly yeah. off the flag. So maybe use a uh, colored marker or something and just put okay. straw existing okay. straw waddles. Okay. And then, and then I just have a quite this has mm -hmm. nothing to do with any really any of it, but well kind of does. If you when you plant and it all grows back, do those squat uh, those wattles do those stay? Or do those just They disintegrate. Do they? Yeah. yeah. Like they're probably gonna be doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> By the time that you get out there. Mm -hmm. Once the snow melts, you'll say, Oh Yeah. The, uh, the only thing that I worry about when you talk about 10 years down the road is it's going to be loam and seed that just immediately goes into the native seed mix and that mow line, like... Well, you need to maintain the mow line. You can't mow on the I other side. Yeah. Put seed so would you say planting <laughs> instead of <laughs> that mix do some plantings? I might just put all seed down and let it grow and... Because yeah, what how are you going to distinguish? The yard that I'm going to yeah. really have left is not much at all. Yeah. Like, so this was a, a oops on my part, and I learned from it. And, I mean, like, I'm not trying to do a huge thing here, really. It was just. Do you like any bushes in particular? Mm -hmm. Like blueberry? They, they Instead of doing the seed mix? Well, I don't want to have, they, because they have thorns. I mean, once he pulls stuff back, they don't have thorns then you get down to right, the yeah. native soil. Oh, did you ever go blueberry picking? No. Yeah. should take them. I'm going to, oh yeah, we've been doing a lot of that type of stuff. <laughs> Pretty cool. Uh, I mean, I could throw in six or six blueberry bushes. And that way it doesn't get a little border. mowed beyond. What do you think about that? Just because Brandy's making a good point with the mowing part. Mm -hmm. So put something so that whoever moves tree to the rock, go further or whatever. you know, okay, maybe yeah, four. This is clear, like manicured, not manicured. Yeah. yeah, like maybe four here and then two between the tree and the other rock. And mark those on the, on the fan. Okay. Where you're going to place them. That's on the edge of where I'm raking back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. Right so on. You can, right so on you can make line. a decision on the plants you can ask your wife on what but she yeah, wants. Yeah. But it they can't be, be invasive. No, but they need to be native. There's a okay. list. Yeah. Like no yeah. burning euonymus yeah. or privet. Although you can't buy this stuff in Massachusetts Well, he's gonna, anymore. he's gonna get the plant approved by us. So if you want to have a couple things that you might like to see. Okay. Um, uh, you've got sandy loam there. So you want to take a look at that. Contact Steve mm -hmm. and get anything like where I can get that stuff. Oh, yeah. yeah. Do we have a list of plants? Do you have a note? Can I kind contact you on the cell phone? Okay, yeah. No, that's not a town number. That's fine. That's it. So we have March 5th or February? March 5th, I mean, February 5th or March 5th? How much time do you need to do your plan? No, I have March this time. Okay. March? Yeah, or or I'll take February too. I'll take the give me February. It's up to you. Give me more time. Why not? Right? Okay. okay. Wait, you want more time? Yeah. Oh, more March. time on the other end. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, Wait, which time? Which one do you want? February. March. March. February. Okay. February. Give me uh, give me uh, February. That's fine. Seven thirty. What's the date? Fifth. Thank you. Time? Seven thirty. So moved. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. 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 
Okay, so we, thanks for coming in. Yeah, thank in you fact, if you want, <laughs> I was saying that. Oh yeah, he's not coming in. It's snowy and we if know. you want to be sure <laughs> and get your all plan time, all done, though. come in and show it to Steve first yeah, before you go to the meeting. Oh, do you have a copy of that? Yeah. That's ours, um, I think. Yeah, yeah that's mine. Yeah. Okay. All right, sounds good. All right, thanks, Thank guys. you. Appreciate it. Good night. Good night. Good night. Okay. Eight. 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 Eight.
Let me see really? yours. Really? You don't have question marks on yours? You, you do. Would, you would never have approved that. Yeah, why did I write two? I got it. So, <coughs> but it did, that does say draft on it, so maybe. <laughs> well, yeah, but they all but say they that. All say they draft. all say draft. <laughs> all right, how well, about. This is true. Yeah. Can we agree that we need. Maria to go tape. back and look at the tape for October 16th, 2017 to fill in the question marks, especially for 7.09 p.m. Walnut Street. Yes, I would. That sounds like deja vu. I think we should. Okay, so now it's on the record, so we can move on to the next <laughs> okay. set of minutes. Let me see. If, did you look in the minutes? If it was in the minutes? These are minutes. These are the other one. Oh. <laughs> did you look in there to see what we did with the minutes? Uh, bum, 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 bum. Which one was it? October. Oh, November. Mm -hmm. Was deferred to the next meeting. Mm -hmm. That's all it said. Hmm. Yeah, that's what she said. All right, so which one are we going to? Have you guys right. done November 13th? So yet? can you give this one to Maria? Um, she can do a little work on that. So the November 13th. A lot of missing DDP numbers. So the Because they hadn't been issued yet, right? Yeah. Yes. At the time. Yeah, but we usually phone them, don't we? No. Well, but we don't fill them in because at the time the public hearing was open, yeah. there were no DEP numbers. Why, I think why so we don't go back and put in the no, no, because at the time of the public hearing, <coughs> there were no DEP numbers. The only time they get filled in I know. is... For ten years from now, when somebody looks at it, it would, it, it, it's a blank, right? Well, <laughs> the, these are minutes only for that night, not for the future. Okay. Well, okay. You get well in that case, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That was... A, but under discussion on like page that. four, uh, Sleepy Hollow, the third sentence, the brook also overflowed. I think we should put the brook was impacted with silt because the brook didn't overflow. It was the whole pit that overflowed into the brook. But I thought the brook went over its banks and flowed out of the main yeah, channel. It says the brook also <coughs> overflowed. So first they mentioned that the erosion control barriers were breached during the heavy rain, but then it says the brook also overflowed. So they were pointing yeah. out that both things happened. And because I asked mm -hmm. Andy if where that silt was coming from. And he said that the the stream had No way. No. There's no way that that stream caused any silt at all. That all came from the pit because I went there the next day, okay. and it all I thought the was banks of went the stream. right down. Well, if anything, the water washed all the silt from the pit. Okay, maybe further it, downstream, but maybe. I didn't see any evidence of okay. that. Um, was it your understanding that the stream overflowed over its banks as well as the breach of the yeah, detention it was basin? Both. But the yeah. stream did not cause any silting. Well, I don't know if it says that. It doesn't no, well, say no. something. It doesn't that say that. It says I thought you the guys just said that. Okay. I'm going to leave it. Which one are you reading? Brook overflow. The date? Okay. Which, Discussion yeah, number one. Which set of minutes? Oh, November 13th. Brook falls. Okay. <coughs> Discussion one. Oh, yes. And okay, there. number two <laughs> further down under there. discussion, it says Mr. Ziff asked Karen Keegan of Andrew's survey. <laughs> Does she work for no. Andrew's survey? No, she doesn't. That's uh, I don't think so. GBI, <laughs> Unless right? You know something. Yeah. She did that one time. <laughs> yes, she did. All right, so it needs to be GBI. Yeah, that's what she works for. Okay. Yeah, that's last time I checked. Okay, just make sure. All right, and that was all I had. 
No, is that Brandy, do you think? Oh, I'm abstaining. I wasn't there. Oh, okay. Yeah. Make a motion to approve the meeting <coughs> minutes for November 13th, 2017 as amended. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Okay, that's abstain. another one. Abstain. Brandy abstains. All right, so that minutes. I got nine o'clock. You got nine o'clock? All right. And that would be the um, 77 Maple? It would. Okay. It would. So the um, Peter no, Ruiz? Yep, you're up. Go slow or a little ahead. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. My watch is off. <laughs> hey. What's up? Douglas Conservation Commission, 29 Depot Street, will hold a public <coughs> hearing for Peter, is that how you say it, Ruiz? Ruiz. Ruiz. On January 8th, 2018, at 9 p.m. at the Municipal Center, 29 Depot Street, for work to be done pursuant to the Town of Douglas Wetland Bylaw and the Wetland Protection Act, MGL 131, Section 40. Proposed work location will be done on 77 Maple Street and involves construction of a single-family home, driveway, well and septic system. Construction activities are within 100 feet of a bordering vegetative native wetland. Thank you. Again, guys. They all came back, so. Okay. She did it. <coughs> right, for the record, Mike Yerka, Civil Site Engineering, <coughs> representing uh, Mr. Uh, Peter Ruiz. Uh, this is a, uh, <coughs> an existing lot uh, on Maple Street. Uh, this is Everybody's familiar with it, the bad corner right here with the large oak tree. It sits mm -hmm. like right over here. There's a culvert that goes underneath the road. An intermittent stream crosses over and flows under Maple Street. It's <coughs> towards the railroad. Yeah, yeah, could you pull it a little closer to the table? Okay, please? sure. Thank you. And that is an intermittent? Oh, yeah. With the culvert yeah. there? Yep. Yeah. Dries up every summer. Okay. So anyway, uh, <clears throat> we've, uh, as you can see, the, the yellow line is basically the zoning offset line. So we've uh, put the, the house uh, in this box. <coughs> this is the 100-foot uh, buffer, the 50-foot buffer. We kept the house out of the 50-foot uh, buffer. It's the 25-foot buffer. And uh, we have a bit of grading on the side of the house that uh, within the 50 foot, buffer, 50 foot buffer and a small amount of the turnaround for the driveway in the 50 foot buffer. Uh, <clears throat> nothing uh, within the 25 foot buffer. Well sets back here. We put the, uh, the, watering, uh, the, wa the watering base in here. And uh, as you can see, the septic system, pretty much most of the septic system is outside the 100 foot buffer. And that's pretty much, uh, no pretty much it. No stock piling on site note on there? Uh, they're probably going to end up hauling the stuff out of here because obviously there is no room. They, the only place they could stockpile would be over the existing, yeah. over the system, and then move that out when they're ready to dig the system. That would be like the end of the uh, project. <coughs> As you can see, it's more more fill here uh -huh. than excavation. So they're probably going to end up bringing stuff in and not. Uh, you want to <coughs> re propose retaining wall over there? Uh. There is no, no we just graded 25 it 25 to 50 on the, near the well? Or is that a foundation drain? That's a yeah, foundation drain, yeah. I'm just imagining what it could be because I cannot <laughs> see anything. Do you, want me, do you want to put a plan on uh, the Yeah. Okay. And then what's happening at the bottom <coughs> left corner? <coughs> bottom what? Left corner. Here? Yes. Nothing. Okay, you can't move that septic at all. Uh, you could probably move it. You could probably move it this way, but then you would start raising it up. 
Okay. You become a, this this comes up up the hill. Mm -hmm. So then you, everything would start raising up with more fill on this end for the driveway. If you're gonna, oh, you do have the deck. I see that yeah. now. Yep. Okay. Yep. The deck on the back. And that deck's outside the uh, the fifty uh -huh. also. Yep. Basically, you drive straight in garage, sloping down to the, you know, grading off to the right-hand side, you know, <clears throat> decent backyard, and uh, uh, gonna be a small, small ranch, a small rear ranch. What's the wetland like out there? You're saying it's drying up? It's, the well, there's the, the yeah, straight there's the stream yeah. dries, yeah. This here, it's mm -hmm. low and pocketed, okay. like a shrub uh, tree, shrub swamp. Did you ever get up? Did you ever well, walk on it? Or did you I not got a response. So I was looking for <laughs> utility pole numbers on the plan. And some yeah, they got utility poles, but you know, no, put the no, numbers, no numbers on. to pinpoint yeah. it, and it wasn't staked. So yeah, no pictures. So was it on the right? No, was it? On it's the on the right hand side, going right around that. Are you going like corner. The leaving town? Almost yes. across from Margaret's entrance. Yes. Hmm. Yeah. Do you want to table. see pictures? Have well, Steve I think go we out? should just check the line. Right. At least. Yeah. yeah. Yep. That's, That's fine. fine. Yeah. When the big thaw happens, Monday. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the end of the week, isn't it? Friday. Isn't it so Friday? Isn't it something 50s. like that? It's going to take more than one day of fifty cents. <laughs> Okay, so Steve will go out and take take pictures for us. Okay, if you uh, give me a heads up, I'll, uh, okay. I'll meet you out yeah, there. Yeah, you need, sure. yeah. Yeah, that'd be great. Yep. <coughs> <coughs> any more questions? Say anything. DEP didn't have any comments. Reach right okay. forward, just close to the bottom. Okay, so um, make motion to continue. 7.5 on the fifth. So moved. Second. Perfect. On 2-5? Yeah. Yes. Okay. All right, you just give me a heads up when you go. Email Margaret, whatever. Hi. Okay? Thanks. All right. All right. Thank you. Thanks for your time. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, are they done? Actually, no. they're done. I don't think they're doing until 915. No. For that RDA? You don't have to wait till 915. No, I hope they know that. Oh. Uh, yeah. yeah. Do we plus we, do we sign everything? No. Yeah, and Lux is here. I didn't mean the right, jinx here. Right. Yeah, you did too. Yes, yeah, so we do still have one more that we didn't do yet. Where is that? The uh, number three under the discussion. Mm hmm. Oh, and our budget. I added that at number six because Maria said we need to vote on our budget. Do we have a copy? I have some information. Well, are you ready, or <laughs> you, got, you still waiting for him, or close enough? I can come forward. Oh, okay. Come on up. All right. Take it now. All right. All right. So, a new plan. Well, I marked up the one that you said to put in. Uh, requested information. Um, he went back to the house and made sure of the measurements. Um, so, I'll let me look at it. The control barrier will be here. Yep. And anywhere else, wherever necessary. I don't know if you require anything else. Okay, so it's 36 feet mm -hmm. and there. Yep. And, and the stockpile will yes. be up there. Yep. And that's clear, wide open, there's nothing there, and it's stream 70 yep. feet from the proposed garage. And what's the 32 referring to? That's the other side from the side of the garage over to 
but it includes the existing driveway to the edge of the property. To the edge of the property? Yes, those are the measurements. I believe I wrote existing driveway and such oh. there. Yes. That's a property line. But it goes line. past the driveway the to the property line. Yes, okay. correct. What is this line? That, that one? This one is the sil silsage. So we're going to do state straw there. waddles. We yeah. can put that in our determination. Yeah. I knew it was either straw or hay because I know when we did ours on 75, you had to use one because you're close to the water. I do understand that. Well, we also can use not uh, straw bales, but we have straw waddles. Yes. Yeah. I've heard of those. I think yeah. those are the little like baggy type things. Correct. Uh, yep, yeah. Yeah. I know. It yeah, you They're don't easier want than funds. the bales. Mm -hmm. Yep. And you mm -hmm. <laughs> you'd have to dig in the toe in the yeah. silk fence. Mm -hmm. Just using Six straw inches. waddles only. Yes. Yeah. Not silk fence. This is a stockpile if need be. That's where we put it up there. So we could put um, straw waddles only. Snake on straw waddles. You're going to try it with the blue pen, are you? No. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> State. Draw waddles. Okay. Yeah. And then we don't have a measurement from the closest edge to this point right here. No, we have the closest the stream. This one, which goes there, to, to there. there. If we knew the distance between there, well, this is kind of curling in just a little bit. Mm -hmm. I don't here know here. if there are any measurements because I know. You know what we could do though is we could say no close for that. We could determine a distance right here, driveway to you know like that. You can make that distance, and so instead of because we don't want them marching out here measuring from the wetland, we don't really want them tromping into the wetland. Yeah. But if we tell them put the erosion control x distance along mm -hmm. the side of the drive, mm -hmm. that yep. makes it easy. All right, so do She's gonna ten feet. Okay, that's almost the same. Yeah. So it's like Pretty much. Let's just say eighty plus minus. So draw another line. Yeah, but let's use something functional. So do you know what I mean? Because otherwise, you're asking them to step into the feet. wetland to figure out this. Oh. No, we don't want that. So we'll do ten foot. Okay. From because it's a nice paved driveway. Mm -hmm. 10 foot from along the edge of the driveway for your erosion control. And you don't need to go down. Yeah. You don't need to go over here with erosion control. I don't know what this This is the driveway, That's right? The driveway. Yep. So nope. you're going to end at this location. Well, with actually, the erosion control. No, actually, they or should let them curl, curl it around a little yeah, bit. Yeah, hug the driveway. Come curl back it in. Around. Yeah. That's good. Right okay. at the bottom there. So aye, aye, aye. erosion control. Mm -hmm. From this point to where? Which location? To all the way down there. No, no I don't <laughs> need that, that would be the lake. <laughs> yeah. What is a good landmark? Let's see here. In the direction. Just put it right here. Well, this is yeah. This is downhill, right? Yep. So yeah, it's all hill. So right. I would. Would not say anything's navigating this way. No. Well, I can, I can go down the driveway, and then go off into the yeah. wind. Pick a point. Since we're Mickey Mousing this, well, you could say the corner of the house right here. I mean, if you want to keep it on that side, or you can pull it forward here. I think you're better off because you'd be going across the driveway yeah. going down the other way. Well, they're concerned with the stuff going, washing down the driveway. Well, why don't we put it on the inside of the driveway and run it down that way? So it's it control on this over. side. If it's on it's the in, on the inside, it's, it's, it's got, you got a stone wall to go, and then it go, would go down there. And if you stay along the inside, 
then nobody can go on this side with any equipment or anything. Nope. Nobody. So you're gonna have. You're only gonna be working with oh, I, oh, so this amount of space. Yeah, yeah. You'd want your driveway. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Let's just say you know go take the erosion control down the driveway till it's about even with the house. Okay. So, so I mean, technically, it technically it's what you had on the map, anyways. Say right here. Even. Yeah. Right about here, end of erosion control? Yeah. Okay. Steve, you're going to remember all this, right? <laughs> but it's so pretty out it. there. How could you not? <laughs> so oh, yeah. curl around the top, down to even with the house, mm -hmm. and the 10 foot along. Just clarify that for me, please. Don't go any farther than 10, 10 feet from your driveway. Okay. Keep it. Keep it up closer to your driveway. So this okay. point here and that yes. L right mm -hmm. there. Erosion okay. control, erosion control. Okay. And may I ask, where do you purchase the straw waddles? Because I know. Robins. 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 A.H. Harris. A.H. Harris or Robins? Okay. Robins. A.H. Yeah. Harris. Can we make them a copy of this? Can we get a copy, Steve? We need a copy. Well, that's what I mean. Yeah. Your pillow. Huh? Your pillow. My pillow? <laughs> you need a my pillow. Oh, my pillow. <laughs> no, it is your pillow, though. <laughs> I'm thinking about one of them. I've never had did, um, Do you have one? No. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know somebody that had one this was years ago. She goes, oh, it's great. And I said, let me know in three years from now. Yeah. yeah. He does the mattress topper now. I saw that on TV. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Something about pressure yeah, points and... I don't know. You mentioned must be making the fortune. Yeah, he used to be on it's the streets, TV, drug addict. Mm -hmm. That's real. It's We're on story. TV, you know. Huh? We're on TV, you no, know. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> What's the request for a local bylaw fee and for coming to that? Okay. Yeah, well, we're done like with this. We don't need him for this anyway, so we've seen, we've all seen the plan. Yeah. So I'll make a motion for a negative oh. RDA. Second. Motion been made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. 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 So that's Aye. good. That means you don't have to file. Thank a you negative very much. RDA means and we yeah, determined yeah. you don't need to file. Thank you very much. And thank you for letting us come back this Well, thank time. you for doing such a nice job, too, getting it done. Yep. Make sure we get everything from that coffee machine. Mm. You didn't check the game out when you went home, did you? No, I didn't. Store. <laughs> for you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, well, that wasn't too bad. Nope. There you go. Again, thank you. I appreciate that for letting us come thank back. You. Um, and yeah, tell all your friends. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we gotta lose another month. <laughs> um, so this means we'll get paperwork in the mail stating that we're all set. Did you guys sign it tonight? Or? Zero to three. Um, second see quarter. if it's in here. So, so I think it's no file. Wow, that's, uh, it's really low. Wow. Where you want, Alabama? <laughs> Seven, 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 eight, three. Seven, three, Fourth and six, Alabama's on the 24th. Oh, it's here. So we'll sign this tonight. Okay. And you can call our secretary, Maria. Correct. And um, ask her when it's ready, and you'll get a copy. Okay. Yeah. So and now I know. I believe it has to be notarized. Yeah. She'll do the paperwork. Now. Yeah. Okay. That's awesome. Thank you. And does that mean we can let the builder know and they take it from there? Or? Well, you're probably for your building permit. Yep. Well, we already, he's, they, he's, 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 he did that he did already. That already. So, well, I haven't signed it. Yeah. Well, that's what yeah. I mean, but it started, put, so it's but that's, I'm just trying section. to look for the procedure because yeah. I don't know, so. Okay. So, once I sign it, then they'll finalize All right. it. What do you got? Let's go. Oh, I got a 915. Building, oh. building inspector will need to sign it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, great. Thank you guys Thank very you. much. Thank you. Okay, I'm like 9.30, I'm leaving. Just to let you know. 
All right. So, and so, um, number three, My we have a request for, for local me. bylaw information. Do we have anybody here for that? Oh, okay. Yep. All right. And, um, it's if you could state your name, please. You wanted to see how it all works. Oh, uh, yeah. Stevens. Okay. And your address? Uh, 31 Brookside Drive. Okay. And um, here we go. what is your question? Um, I, I think just just three parts. Um, kind of like when was it established? Um, how is the fee regulated? And like what um, Mass General Law is it tied to? I've, I've just never heard of it and seen it. So because we all new to me. Um, so this is our fee schedule. I got a copy of that. And it, we held a public hearing on December 4th, 2006. So it was advertised mm -hmm. and posted as a public hearing. And, um, and, and the fees go towards it, oh, cost, the fees expense? Go to, they go into the, all our um, fees for the bylaw go into the general fund. Mm -hmm. In other words, they go for the towards fire department, schools, and not no, probably not ambulance, but okay. Okay. cover this building. The people to that the work town. here. Right, to the town, but okay, not, yeah. not to the purpose of no. conservation. It, no, not to the purpose of wetland. No, okay, not at all. Um, that's uh, yeah, pretty much all I could dig up on our bylaws. It, but we did have a public something? hearing, and okay. this is a copy of the fee schedule. I'll get right back. Yeah. yeah. Les, what's the name of your construction company? <laughs> huh? Mm -hmm. Am I asking this uh, for what the, what's the purpose? I was just asking this as a as a resident. Oh. The reason? Not as a contractor. Not as a contractor. So it's Mass General Law Chapter 44, Section 53G. The commission may impose reasonable fees for employment of outside consultants engaging mm -hmm. sure. by engaged by commission. Mm -hmm. Can I get a copy of that? Can you make him a copy, Steve? Can, yeah, Maria should have a copy. Mm -hmm. I don't have the, the passcode for the copy. <laughs> but they do go into our general bylaw. Okay. We have another general account. Account. Yeah. I mean, our general, yeah. general yeah. Yeah. account. He's asking yes. just for that. So then yeah. the other, um, the portion that we get for notice of intent filings, that goes for what? Our conservation fund. Right. Yes, we have two accounts. We have a wetland protection fund and the um, wetland filing fees fund. Fund, and then we have the general bylaw mm -hmm. funds. So we actually have three accounts. Three okay. accounts. Okay. Yeah. But the general bylaw funds uh, oh. bylaw. Go into the general. So general fund. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I, I got um, just one other unrelated question. Um, the, what goes? I, I know tonight, someone with you guys were talking about water, water health and conservation. Which yep. board goes first and stuff like that? Um, what what goes? What board comes first related to ZBA and conservation? I know there's always a, you know, the cart and the horse type of deal and stuff like that. In your, you know, I mean, just just in your minds and stuff like that. Well, that's because if um, we close a public hearing, mm -hmm. and somebody's still in front of the ZBA, yeah, and that our public power portion is closed, and ZBA says, "Well, no, we want you to move it over here." Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, then that's they're going to have to come back, <laughs> yeah. and refile. Mm -hmm. Our position typically is everybody else closes and then we close. Then you guys close off. That, that's well, same that's thing with Board of Health if if it's. Yep. Closer to a wetland, and we can see the septic on the plan shows it's mm -hmm. 70 feet from yeah. the wetland. We would like to make sure the Board of Health isn't going to say, "Oh no, move it yeah. over here." Usually, we because yeah. then we don't have a more real than plan. CBA needs to make yeah. their decisions law based. Correct. They Correct. should be. Yeah. So well. we can bend a little bit with extra erosion control or additional mm -hmm. conditions, mm -hmm. but yeah, that was that was it. I think. Yeah, typically it's no more of a delay than a month. Yeah. Most of the other boards are pretty quick, too. Okay. Right. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. All Do right. You not going to make me a copy? <laughs> What's that? Not going to make a Make a motion to adjourn. Thanks. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. 
I don't uh, care about the budget. Already, oh, already budget. <laughs> yeah, it's already, you got It's already been seconded. What are we doing for the budget? Why does it's it unrecognized? <laughs> Just vote on the lousy budget of. It's been seconded. Well, Not recognized. The first time. I'm ignored. I know, ignored. Mike. I know. Well, do no. you agree to level fund? You can't do business fund. after it's been motioned and seconded. You can't. You can't do separate business. It's just any discussion? Laws. Well, any discussion? I have something to say. <laughs> yeah, but you can't bring up new no, business. Did you vote on the uh, nope. No. No, no I mean, vote. you can retract it. Yeah. No. Fine, I'll vote, retract vote, it. Vote no to adjourn. Either way. But you have to deal with a seconded motion. You can't ignore it. You have to actually handle it. So you gotta Okay, so I retract my thing, my motion. Mike, second that. I second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. So the budget for last year was $2,789. Would you like to level fund yes. $2,789? So moved. For 2018. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Do I have a motion to adjourn? So moved. Second. Motion made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Uh, All right. We didn't lose yet. So we off now? Ask her. Are we off? Nope. You're off now. Yeah.